Hey, what's up my gorillas, gorillettes, gorillings, whatever you go by, it's Wes here at Gorilla Investment Corporation. And what do we love to do? We love to talk about the psychology around trading. It's your one-stop shop for that. This is the No Shill Channel. I'm not here to sell you a damn thing. I just wanna help you towards financial success and give you some of the gems that I wish I was given a lot earlier in my investing career. What am I talking about today? Of course, it's AMC. Today was supposed to be a big day in terms of the shareholders meeting in which Adam Aaron was possibly gonna, you know, have a recount going on. We were gonna hear about who was announced as, you know, on the board of directors. He postponed that to July 29th. What does that mean for me and my position with AMC? Uh, let me think about it. I'm buying more. I took some profit from cryptocurrency and bought more AMC in that $9 window today and I'm absolutely thrilled about it. I suggest you do whatever you want to do with your money, but what I did today is I got more of my position established and I'm absolutely thrilled that it's staying in this channel to give me the opportunity to maximize on this squeeze. What am I gonna do with all of this money? Some people have asked me that if I this squeezes and I become a millionaire a 10 millionaire 100 millionaire what I'm gonna do first and foremost I'm not gonna change who I am I'm gonna be the same person I'm going to invest those that you know around me that I love I'm gonna help others you know this is what is so amazing and monumental about this opportunity this is not a bunch of 99% greedy people that are gonna be absorbing these funds this is gonna be some people that really want to help everybody around them and the planet. And this is really, not everybody is gonna be that way, but I think a lot of us are. And that really excites me that this community, these people that have never had the fortune of being born with silver spoons, a lot of you, including myself, I don't come from much at all. I've worked very hard to get to where I am. And you're here because I'm sure you work hard as well. What I need to talk about is just this. If you don't have conviction in this play, it's gonna be very difficult for you because there's gonna be more and more price fluctuations. Let me use an example. If this runs up to $100 and you've been in this thing for six months, you might be, wow, this is a good time for me to just you know, get out of it because it's so stressful. That's not gonna work because this thing's gonna run way beyond that. So if you're stressed out now, if you bought it 12 and it dropped to nine, imagine how you're gonna feel if you bought it 12 and it went to 1200. You're gonna be like, oh my goodness, how am I gonna do it? Those hands start keep them diamond stick together guys we got to keep our heads in this game psychology is a huge part of this you can dig into all the technical analysis you want if it's at 90,000 are you going to be able to hold till it's a hundred thousand what's your selling strategy you know what I had one I don't have one anymore I'm just going to hold it all the way to the moon and when all of us collectively decide to let it go that's when I'm going to start selling it and I'm going to buy shares at the end of this as well because I support a company that gave me the opportunity for generational wealth. Adam Aaron knows that. There's no time limit on this. He's going to push that out uh, to the end of the summer here. That's fine. I wasn't going to sell anyway until it goes all the way to where I'm comfortable because remember, we set the price. On my next channel, I'm going to tell you a little bit about who I am in more depth. I'm going to show you a little bit of what I do in my daily life. We're going to get to know each other a little bit more and talk about that in the comments. Today, I want you to leave a comment about what you're going to do with your your attendees, if you bought some more shares today, if you wish you had some more dry powder, what your plans are to get some more dry powder. I love these conversations. Dry powder, for those who don't know, is basically just cash, cash influx to put towards an investment. Once again, invest at your own risk. I speak from the heart with conviction. I hope you're enjoying the channel. Let's have a lot of fun here moving forward and make sure to subscribe and tell a friend about it. It's Wes. Have a lovely day.